Hello everybody, welcome to the channel. Today we're gonna take a look at Tesla full self-driving feature. This was enabled to me by Tesla for free. As you can see, or in here that I have my Tesla Model Y over here. And I'm gonna show you how the auto park works. This is the best, one of the best features that Tesla ever made. We're gonna take a look at it. So right now I'm not in a parking lot. This is where my vicinity is. I'm in, you know, basically over here and I'm gonna show you where I'm at. So here I'm in my location to, you know, you can see uh, it has couple of parking over here. I can choose whatever I want to park. I could come over here, park here, park here, park here. I can choose whatever I want. So I can choose whatever I want. So let's just say that's a handicap. We don't want to park in handicap. So we're going to go ahead and actually park next to the handicap. To do that, I sim all I have to do simply is hit start. By hitting start, it's going to go ahead and start doing the parking for us. So here, let, let's do this. Press start. I'm going to let it go with the accelerator. So now it's actually doing this by itself. So like you can see here, I'm not touching the wheel. It's doing all of it by itself. You can see here, it's going into the parking. You can see that it's going in, and that's what the camera view is, so, so you can get a better feeling of it. So it's going into the parking, okay? Voila, it's in. So that's one of the best features that Tesla Full Driving have, and I have this feature only for a brief period so I only have this feature for until May 11th so I wish they could give me a, a little bit more time but they're not you know it's a trial feature would I pay for this feature I would probably pay for the auto park feature if it was just that one I wouldn't pay for all the other features because I don't think I need to you know the full self-driving I tried it it's really nice but I don't know I still don't know if I would pay for 8000 or 12000 however much it costs right now. I think right now it's reduced to 8000 before at one point it was 15000 So yeah, now let's go back and do this again. We're going to try this on a different type of parking. So like parallel parking. I don't think I have any parallel parking over here, but we can try it for sure. So let's go ahead. I'm going to go ahead and this goes go out. And you can see I'm going out right now. What if I want to park straight? So he has that, the back one. If I want to park the next next to this one, let's just watch what happens here. I'm going to park all the way to this one. Yeah, let's park maybe here. Yeah, or next to it, yep, we're going to go all the way there. So we're parking all the way there basically by the cone almost. So we're missing two parking spots. So we're gonna hit start. How is this gonna? How is he gonna do it? Let's find out. So I click on start. So it's doing its thing. It went by the curve, and now it's basically going cutting the wheel. You can see this. It's all going all the way there. This is the vision based technology. This is the 2023 Model Y. So definitely very good. Now there's no car over there. So if there was a car, I think it would probably would be hard struggling, but there's no car. So, or maybe it won't be struggling, but I don't know. We'll see, we'll see. But right now it's trying to park here. It's not done. It's fixing up itself. So he's fixing it up. Still fixing it. I gave her hard work. That's why I did. He's cutting the wheel. Yeah, that's what we he's still he's still trying. This is definitely a homework, <laughs> yes. Will he, able, will he be able to do it? So I knew this was going to be a struggle. And I think it's almost done now. So it's definitely... He wants to be perfectionist. There you go. He got it. He got it. 
So let's look outside if it did really get it. So this is outside of it. And you can see it gets in the light in the line over here. And then uh, let's see on the other side over here. It definitely got it definitely got it so yeah definitely auto park is a good feature but it's too much it costs too much money it costs extremely too much to get it so it would be nice if they can make it cheaper but yeah i like it so that's all i have guys thanks for watching and let me know what you think of the auto park feature would you pay for it alone do you think tesla should make a single feature for everybody or do you like the way the fact that it's uh, bundled into the full self-driving? Because that's definitely expensive. And I don't think anybody will want to pay for that. Yeah, that's my opinion. Let me know what you think. Thanks. Bye-bye.